The NHL Awards was held in Nashville, Tennessee last night, and the big trophy of the night, the Hart Memorial, goes out to the most valuable player. There's our three nominees, Connor McDavid, David Pasternak, and of course, our third nominee, Matthew Kachuk. And I'm not sure what this guy's problem was. The entire night, this guy just looked like the Grim Reaper. He wasn't very happy, and I, I don't know if it's because he knows going in that uh, he's not going to win. I'm not sure what it is, but you can tell when Connor McDavid gets named, this guy doesn't even applaud, man. He's just... He's just salty, bro. I'm not sure what his issue is. Maybe he's still upset about not taking the cup home or not playing in the final game of uh, the Stanley Cup playoffs. But uh, anyways, Connor McDavid won by a landslide. It wasn't even close. Um, I mean, it's arguable that Matthew Kachuk could have been the most valuable player for the Florida Panthers. I mean, heck of a season they had uh, making it to the playoffs. But the playoffs don't count towards this award. It's about the regular season who was the most valuable player and. It was Connor McDavid, 153 points. I mean, it's it's not even close. And a really nice touch here by the National Hockey League flying in the Stelter family. Uh, for those of you that don't know, Ben Stelter, their son, uh, passed away from brain cancer. And he was a super fan of the Edmonton Oilers and had a very special relationship with Connor McDavid. And uh, there's Connor McDavid uh, thanking Biz for the hot tub. So I'm not sure what that's about. It sounds like Biz bought him a hot tub, not like Connor McDavid can't afford one. Uh, there's Pasta, and there's Matthew Kachuk once again, just, uh, I'm not sure what his issue is. He's just angry, man. <laughs> so, uh, but maybe that's going to give him fuel to uh, make sure that the Florida Panthers uh, go the distance again next year. I'd love to see that. And there's Connor McDavid thanking his teammates, and he basically said that the Edmonton Oilers have unfinished business. So, for those of you saying out there that Connor McDavid can't win the big one, uh, never with the Edmonton Oilers... Uh, look, guys, this isn't the NBA. He's not demanding a trade. He's not like LeBron James and wants to go on a different team or Kevin Durant to, to win a championship. He's got pride, and he's going to win a cup with the Edmonton Oilers. And there is Connor McDavid's fiance, newly engaged. But let me know your thoughts in the uh, comments, guys. Will Connor McDavid win the big one with the Edmonton Oilers? I most definitely think so. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.